Rosa Rodriguez. We will now uh, move on to uh, member states interventions. We will start with uh, Albania. After Albania, uh, Cameroon, Denmark and Kazakhstan will follow. The floor is open for Albania. Ladies and gentlemen, distinguished colleagues, today we gather with a shared commitment to confront two critical challenges of our time, preventing conflict and sustaining peace. Conflict and violence, whether driven by political, social or economic factors, inflict suffering and hinder progress towards a peaceful world. They fracture societies, displace families, and extinguish hope. Today, more than ever, we face numerous challenges in the field of security and public order. Organized crime, drug trafficking, terrorism, and cybercrime are global threats without borders, and they require a common and a coordinated response. All of us in this summit know that synthetic drugs are now the number one killer of Americans aged 18 to 45. The types of synthetic drugs affecting nations around the globe may vary. In some countries it may be methamphetamine or ketamine, in others, tramadol, captagon, fentanyl. As we are responsible for the health and life of our citizens, we have to take a strong action against production, trafficking, use, dependence, and overdose deaths by synthetic drugs. Dear participants, policing is a crucial public service. Working in the public interest, while fostering public trust and confidence and taking pride in offering an excellent service to the public. To get the public trust, the police forces or services must embrace high standards of honesty, integrity and ethical behavior in connection with the performance of their policing functions. The public deserves to have full confidence in the officers who have been tasked with upholding the law and keeping them safe. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much.